sounds so funny. <laughs> Hello, hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to be talking about my December favourites. I don't know if you re no, remember, but I did my October favourites, so, you know, click on the link here. <laughs> uh, yeah, I didn't do any November ones because I didn't really have anything going on in November. I was just really busy with work and stuff, so really I didn't buy anything. But yeah, my uh, December favourites, shall we? My first December favourite, um, I know everything is like winter over in America and like the other side of the world, but in Australia it is summer. But because I live in Melbourne, it doesn't matter because we have four seasons in one day. So, my favourite that I've come to love is this nice blanket and it's nice and warm and it's just beautiful and I, and, and it's just, I'm just going to wear it during this entire video because it's so comfortable. And I just love laying down with it. Another couple of favourites. Um, okay, op shops. I didn't realise how much I would actually be in love with them. But um, I found this here. This is like a little jar. And I've redone my whole room. So if anyone wants to like a room tour kind of thing, uh, tell me if you want to like kind of see that because I'll do a video on it if anyone's interested. Anyway, I put my... Um, my candle in it. It's vanilla, I think. Yes, it is. It's vanilla, and I just put it in there. And I'm gonna actually put some sand in it so that the candle stays in one place. But this is one of my favorites, and it was only like two. Was it? Yeah, it's only two dollars, and it's just a little jar that I put in my room. Oh, it's tangled. This necklace right here, and it just like it's good when you have like. A lower cut um, circular kind of neckline and it just sits like really daintily and it was really cheap it wasn't like it's not like real gold or anything or real silver but it's just one of those ones that you know you get from Ali or something and yeah it's just it's just beautiful talking about op shops I bought this it's like a little plate and basically what I put on it is my days like when I'm taking off jewellery or, or no, I'm going to wear it the next day. This is on my bedside table and I just put it on there and it's just really pretty and really, I'm sure it's old. Oh, it's made in England. I didn't know that. Okay, so as in entertainment wise, because um, those are my little trinkets, uh, my favourite thing entertainment wise lately, apart from like keyboard and painting and you know, all my other hobbies is this. I just got back into it. It's The Sims 2 Pets. I actually have <laughs> I have the actual Sims 2 and, and Sims 2 Cast Away but I haven't actually, you know, delved into those yet because, you know, um, how else do you get a perfect love life, you know, without having to actually meet people? You make it up yourself and then they can't run away. Okay, I just finished this book, Anna and the French Kiss. Now, I'm no book reviewer, but it's so damn good. Um, it's an easy read, and I, it's not actually that, it's not corny. It's actually really nice, and it has some really real relationship things in there that I could actually relate to. And, um, you know, it's just got a good, you know, handsome guy in there girl that thinks she doesn't fit in, you know, cl some cliche things, but the topics that they touch on is real and how relationships with anyone isn't black and white, that things are in a grey area and it's confusing and yeah. And then the French Kiss guys, I gave it a 4 out of 5 on Goodreads, if anyone wants to follow me on Goodreads I will have the link below or here. I have like a chill list on my iTunes that I have. So this is the Broods.
But they are actually my current favourite, especially the Brutes are like always listening to that last song. I'm going to actually do a video I think about it because it has such meaning to it. But anyway, I will leave that for another video. Thanks everyone for joining in. Hope you enjoyed. Um, if you have any questions, just let me know. Comments down below. Subscribe, like, all that jazz. And I'll catch you on the flip side. Bye!